My name is Mike with Haas Corporation. Today I'm here to go over our new Haas 2000 HS model and show you how to do a quick and easy filter replacement. As you can see up on the top display here, we have a readout that says install filter. The filter that's in the unit has reached its end of life and it's time for a new one. The filters we use are 3000 gallon filters and this is a model 6428. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to remove this bottom access panel with two screws on each side. There's a star nut supplied in the package as well. Pivot this panel up and it pops off. And now you have access to your filter cartridge. One of the great things about our filters on these models, it's on a pivot, so you can pivot this out to easily access your filter for the change. So we're gonna quarter turn left and pull out, and your old filter can pop out. And then here we have our new filter. You're just gonna line up the filter, push it in, quarter turn back in, and then you can pivot that filter, filter back in. Now we can see that our bottle saved count is back, no longer flashing install filter, and we are filtering. Um, so we can put the access panel back on and, and you're good to go on that change. If you did want to swap this filter out for a strainer, so this is our strainer cartridge model 6434, you can do that. This is also supplied in the, in the packaging. It's the same quarter turn in, push in and then the same quarter turn and pivot back in. And now you can see that that filtering icon has gone off. So this unit is no longer filtering. People using this unit know that. And this is a five year rated strainer. We're going to keep this unit as a filtered unit. So we're going to install that filter back in. We'll read out our bottle saved. It now says filtering and we can put on our bottom apron and be good to go. If you'd like to know more about the Revive Hydration Station product family, you can go do so at hosco.com backslash revive. Have a great day, everybody.